With walking sticks in hand and one seeing eye dog in tow, this group of hikers hits the trail. Sometimes I show up without my dog and I have my husband and everybody complains because I didn't bring my dog and I say, well, I brought this one instead. <laughs> I have two guide dogs. It's just a joke. Love you, dear. That's Marsha Wick and her husband, Barry, and Marsha's service dog, Vivianne. Are you a good girl? Sit. Is she sitting? Sit. <laughs> But thanks to the group vibes, she and the rest of these blind and visually impaired people can enjoy outdoor activities like anybody else. As I was losing my sight, you lose the ability to drive, you lose the ability to go skiing, you lose the ability to go out hiking until I met this group. And I still can't drive. <laughs> but, you know, they get us out, they keep us active. They share their eyesight with us. Marsha's two sisters are also part of the club. One has the same genetic vision loss that Marsha has, and the other one is a guide. I don't define them as, this is my blind sister. It's just, this is my sister Vicky, and this is my sister Marsha. That's all it is. The rest of it is just part of who they are, an element. A lot of the guides are significant others, like Marsha and Vicky's husbands, but one of them joined on a whim. And Don has been part of the group for almost 30 years now. And he's done it so much, a lot of the times when he's walking with people, he forgets they can't see. Well, the joy it brings me, you ask, and that's the right phrasing, because it is just a pure joy. And it takes what might be a relatively routine activity, like hiking or skiing, and just amplifies it by sharing it with somebody else. No matter the activity, the group always has a good time. Thankful for the trust they've built with one another, and showing the world that they can do anything. Look what they can do and do it well and enjoy it and routinely. And uh, for employers, for the general public, people need to be aware of that in the community. It's an adventure for all of us and it's a challenge for all of us and it's very rewarding.